Hi there. Now that we have created the accounting calendar, it's time to create the chart of account structure. And if you have been following my previous videos, I have clearly shown you how to go about creating the value sets for your chart of account structure as well as the accounting calendar. Let's go to Oracle Fusion SaaS application and there I'm going to show you how to go about creating the accounting structure as a part of your Fusion financial application setup. All right, so here we are on Fusion SaaS applications. And before I forget, let's quickly have a look at the release and version of this Fusion SaaS application. So we are on release 13 with a version of 23D, okay, which I believe is the latest Fusion SaaS at the moment. Now, in order to go for creating a new chart of account structure, you've got to look for a task called as manage chart of account structure. So here I've typed a part of that. So make sure you click on this and then click on the hyperlink. And here I'm gonna create a new structure. So you have to hit the create button. So I'm gonna go into actions Let's see. So here I will first go into manage structures and then I will click on the plus icon to create a new one. I'm going to give some code here. So OR for orange, GL, COA. Okay. And then you can give a name here or orange, GL, chart of accounts structure and give the same name over here, delimiter. You can give a delimiter of dash and it's enabled. Make sure you save it before you create the segment. All right, and I'm gonna hit the save button and then I will hit the create icon to create the segments and associate my value sets within those segments, okay? So the first one is the company one, company segment, so look for primary balancing segment as the first one. Okay. So you can give a segment code over here as OR company. And you can say as zero one if you like. And alternatively, you can take this off. Okay, you can say orange company, give the same description, sequence number, say 10, prompt, say company. Okay, and selected labels. A short prompt, I would say the same thing, company. And display width, you can give as, as you like. You see, in fact, the width of that field is just two, but here you can, you can give, if, if it's a larger one, say 10, and column name, so I'm gonna select segment one and default value set code is OR, starting with OR, okay? Let's go and search. You 
search by the description okay so here you look for orange coa okay so this is all set for company i'm going to click on save and close so the company segment is created and likewise i'm going to create the second one which is cost center segment so okay or and name department i'll give the same description sequence number 20 display width I'm going to give the same thing let's say 20 and column name I'm going to give a segment 2 and value set code OR underscore GL search for that and this is the value set you've got to use selected labels uh, look for cost center segment and hit save and close so that is our department then the third one we have is account so or account I'm going to give the same thing as the description sequence is 30 prompt is orange account short prompt is just account display width I'm going to give as 30 column name is segment 3 value set code is or underscore gl and there it is and here you choose natural account segment okay hit the save and close and I want to see something here in department okay I'm done all right the next one is intercompany so I'm gonna give OR enter company and name orange enter company same description sequence number 40 and here I'm going to choose enter company segment short is enter company okay and display width I'm going to give as 10 column name segment 4 and default or underscore GL so look for the value set starting with this okay choose the intercompany hit the OK button and you're all done so hit the save and close button and then select the last one for creating the future segment or So this is 50, choose the future segment, and I don't know, I think it, you have got to select one based on your uh, company's future requirement so I'm going to say local use segment okay 
display width so 10 and column name segment 5 value set code or underscore gl select the future segment all right once you're done hit the save and close so here you are and you have basically created all the segments that uh, you've decided as a part of your GL accounting key flex field structure then you save and close again and uh, and you just try to see if it comes in the search okay here it is coming then hit the done button